All right, guys, we're headed up, uh, trying to get out of this fog. The weather is changing today, and I got a feeling up above the fog, uh, the sun will come out and get those squirrels moving. Hey, don't get traditional archery blues just because falls over. Get out here and get after some of these squirrels and coyotes and those kind of things. Follow us, that's what we're doing. So we've arrived in Narnia. We look pretty cool down there. Um, we're back out here after some squirrels. I'd really like to get some squirrel enchiladas going. Um, I'll probably have to tell Misty it's chicken. I got a little bit above the fog. Um, the weather's changing and usually that change of weather gets the animals moving but so far it looks pretty dead up here we're on this eye out for some uh, silver grays some silver gray squirrels um, they're pretty big hey if you guys like this stuff please 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 subscribe down below you don't know how much it helps hey, I heard you want to leave this place but we grew up this old town, just put it all behind Remember you and I Dear Heavenly Father, I come to you asking for your blessing on my heart Let me bring home some meat to the family Lord, I also thank you for all that you've created and what you've given us so Please, Lord, be with me today as I head out Bring me back home safely and please, Lord, provide for my family through what you provide here. I pray this in your name, Jesus Christ. Amen. we were so we could see and hear the water run. River's gonna cry when you're gone. There's no place to turn around down there, so we're, uh, I'm gonna back all the way out of here. Ouch. Ouch! That's not good. Ouch! Okay, here we go. Let's try this again. Alright, so what's going on here is, uh, I got on this old road bed, and I've, uh, it's an old logging road, so I'm doing the cat road shuffle for uh, squirrels, but uh, I've seen a lot of squirrels in here in the past, and I'm hoping that they're not uh, held up, you know, because they, they do that in the winter. They'll get to where they just kind of hang out and eat their, the nuts they got stored. So hopefully they're, I'll run into a couple. Gonna cry when you are 
River's gonna cry when you're River's gonna cry when you're gone He's, uh, you can see that brown spot in the middle. It's about the size of a squirrel. We'll shoot him. Hey, I was hoping you would stay, but I've always known that you would go find your own way. I still see when we climbed up in those trees, 12 years old, to feel the wind. Watch the river run And the sun would always shine When we sat there, you and I The river's gonna cry when you're Gone, 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 gone The river's gonna cry when you're Gone, gone Not a bad group. A little bit too close, actually. Oh well. Alrighty, let's go see if we can get a squirrel now. Hey, I heard you want to leave this place, but we grew up this old town. Just leave it all behind. River's gonna cry when you're gone. So uh, we moved out of the bottom there because of the, because of the private ground. And now I'm up here. I might be too high. Might be out of the squirrels just because of weather. You know, they try to stay out of the weather this time of year. But uh, we're going to go hike down this road. I don't know how I always find myself going to elk country. I'm just kind of naturally drawn to it. There's a lot of the madrone here. So uh, we should find some squirrels. We'll, we'll go down and take a look. see all of those uh, pine cones that have been chewed up and we just got that low coming in I'm not sure if they're out and about they're probably holed up boy this looks like bear country <laughs> or big old rosy country so I've decided to sit here and wait him out he's right in here somewhere it's a big old bull squirrel uh, yeah he's a uh, I'm pretty much in his territory, I can see. I mean, there's all, all sorts everywhere right here. So this is territory. If only I had a bugle. I need to get a squirrel bugle. Man, I would, I would light this place up with a squirrel bugle. Pretty cool place. All right, we're gonna wait him out for a bit. Uh -huh. 
he woke back up. I heard him over here. I'm gonna go in. I think it's a, a one of the smaller squirrels, but a uh, small gray squirrel. It's not the big silver gray, but uh, we'll go after him too. And uh, I just left the pack behind. I'm gonna run over and see if I could get a shot at him and, and see if we could uh, get a little bit of dinner. I heard him running around the trees. He just piped up again. And then he shut up, but uh, that blow that was promised today is moving in pretty fast right now. So I don't really know how much longer I have. I'm trying to listen for him walking around up there. See if I could see him up here. And we'll, uh, oh. All right, it's gonna be hard to get him on camera. You guys let me know down below if uh, if you want to see the times that I go out and I don't get anything or if you just like me to keep uploading um, I like uploading you know it's about the venture the venture of it to me it's about getting out here it's about getting out of the house and and doing a little bit more um, in the winter so that's the whole reason I came out um, I'm gonna keep showing you southern Oregon unless you absolutely tell me hey man don't come back on here until you get some squirrels. <laughs> it's not about that. It's about the uh, the whole moving through it. You know, we live in a culture today that is so instant gratification. And and uh, if you take up traditional bow hunting, it's not an instant gratification thing. And it's about the hunt. So come on out. Um, let me know what you think. If you guys are enjoying this, man, give me a thumbs up down there. It's it's it really helps out a lot. And also. Um, subscribe and and uh, leave me some comments tell me what you're thinking is it good so far all right I'm gonna head out of here I'm gonna head home 
uh, before I get wet because it's coming in quick and pretty much everything has gone to bed. Oh.